what is the process like as far as choosing startups to work with and making the decision to acquire them? Yeah, so you know, um, in terms of the process, what we try to do in Fordex is run in lean 90 day cycles. So every 90 days we try to create a new product and then we test it out in the market. And you know, we do a learning experiment, sometimes we do transactional learning experiments. We assess product market fit. Once we, once we see that there's product market fit, we then make a choice on build by partner. And we do that based on market timing, based on how fast we want to grow, based on uh, any of the uh, opportunities that may be out there to buy. Sometimes there's nothing. Some of these opportunities we're looking at, there's no one you can buy. You have to create it yourself. So it's always a different set of factors depending on the opportunity. Right, and I mean, other automakers in this space are looking at other forms of mobility as well, namely scooters, bike sharing, I mean, you name it. So how does Ford stay competitive in this ever-changing landscape? It's a great question. So within uh, our mobility business, you know, we've developed a framework, and one of the things that we have to get comfortable with is that um, different forms of mobility are gonna come in and out. Right, two years ago there was no scooters, today there's scooters everywhere. And that's gonna happen with other modes. And so within Ford we've developed a really good framework and we have things like Canvas, which is our short-term leasing program. We have non-emergency medical transport, which is our uh, you know, business to transport people in non-emergency situations. You know, we have Spin now. And so these assets are all coming in and we're, we have a good framework in assessing how they work individually and how they can work together. And I think for Ford, one of the things that we've really done as a company, uh, both empowered by Bill Ford and Jim Hackett, is make mobility a strategic pillar within our company. So my boss, Marcy Claiborne, who reports to Jim, she has uh, sits at the same level as um, Jim Farley, the head of our markets, and Joe Heinrich, the head of our operations. So mobility for Ford is one of our strategic pillars that's at the same level as our other parts of our core business. Hey everyone, thanks so much for watching Investors Business Daily on YouTube. If you want to watch more videos, make sure you hit that subscribe button so you don't miss a thing.